What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Rich the Hedgehog Gaming, and today um, I want to talk about why I haven't been uploading lately, and you know all that kind of stuff. I'm trying to get my thing right. Hold on, <laughs> gotta put this on top. Okay, there we go. Uh, why I have not been uploading lately? Okay, and the reason why is because my PS5, which is as you over there. It's not uploading my videos like I wanted to. And I think the reason why is because, um, you know, the PlayStation 5 recently had an update. So now it's not even uploading my videos like I wanted. And it's not even, I came up broadcast anything. I came to live stream. I tried to live stream earlier, um, you know, for the weekend or whatever. But I couldn't do that because it automatically shut off. So, uh, hopefully, this is not a freaking messed up PlayStation 5 because I'm gonna be like really pissed off at this. But, um, I pre you know pre recorded all my Kingdom Hearts little videos I did and have them up and ready, and I couldn't upload them. So, this is technically part seven. Um, Kingdom Hearts made a memory. Um, if you guys watching or whatever, but let me shut up and let you all listen to it. If I can find my controller, and I find my controller, all right. Uh, play. play. So, hey, you see me in the background. Ha. Enjoy. That is loud. Oh yeah, as y'all can see, this is actually recorded. I'm not actually playing this. I'm sorry you really can't see everything because this thing is like really up close. But, um, yeah, anyway, I think most of all these videos are like 30 to 40 minutes long, which I don't know why I make them long, anyways. Um, so I, I think this was like 30 minutes long, maybe 40 minutes, I don't know. I can't remember. But, um, yeah, these, these videos I tried to get up and it would not upload for some reason. It keeps talking about some weird error, um, with it almost finished uploading, but. Um, I'm trying to get this out right now. 
and hopefully um they can fix this stupid issue for um let me see for this PlayStation 5. I ain't have a, I ain't had no issue until this update happened. So Sony need to get on it. Oh yeah, and also probably after this one, I'm gonna try to upload another one, but it's gonna have to be through my phone, um, as y'all can see. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to upload another video after this, after this video here, and um, hopefully, hopefully they'll fix this. But I've been recently recently playing Get Your Impact and um, Godfall. Um, I mean, I'll be on, I'll be on them for like quite some time. Now. It's kind of hard to do this and play all, um, all the other games I got. Oh yeah, I, I unlocked Team Days too. <laughs> They're actually pretty dope. Pretty much, I unlock everybody on here. Um, when I was doing it by myself and try to record and all that, but. For some reason, I can't upload it, which I'm going to try to upload on my phone. Life sucks. 2020 is a bad year.
Let's let you know I'm a Keyblade Master. <laughs> oh, jeez. Ouch. I think on this one I actually killed it. If I'm not mistaken. But like most of all these I haven't uploaded, I killed most of them. I might take like one, two, maybe three damage. Um out of some uh, most of the videos, but other than that I actually killed it. Those for you who doesn't know anything about Kingdom Heart, this is like the best game to play right now. Just to get caught up with Kingdom Hearts in general. Instead of going out and get, you know, all the other games, but I highly recommend to go get them and play them and like experience it. But if you want to get caught up on the story wise, just to get this the game like to actually get. So, you know, from my opinion, my honest opinion. If you, want to, uh, if you want to get caught up with the store. Alright, that's that. See, I, mean, I killed that. Watch this. All it's rank. Plus, plus, plus. Look at that. I mean, Avery, plus, plus. Look at that. All that. Full chain, baby. <laughs> level 23. I wonder what's the high level cap on here. I think it's like level 99. I believe it's level nine, um, 99, but I, you know, I killed that son, look at that. I think I was doing something, oh yeah, I was doing something at that point. I had to get sword in for this one. I think, did I get sword in? No, I didn't. Yeah, I did get sword in. And the way how I'm doing this, I'm doing this like, okay, sword fight, zip bar on this. And pretty much I'm basically doing like how it how it went down in the actual game itself. Say so this is the part of it's sword fight, zip bar, um, Psyx. So I picked Team Sora to, for this song specifically. If I tell you my thumb was hurting for all this right here, it was legit hurting. I kid you not. 
And this is also one of my favorite Kingdom Hearts songs too. Battle themes actually. Like, I was focused on getting full change on this because I like this theme song specifically. I actually got it, like, on my phone downloaded so I could listen to it. But it's, like, one of my top favorite songs on this, uh, Kingdom Hearts in general. Look at that. A++++ plus 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 full change. No misses. That's gold. That's gold. I messed up on that, but I don't care. All right, cutscene. To ensure that Sora would make it to Organization 13's headquarters, Axel sacrificed himself. Roxas appeared within Sora and challenged him for the right to exist. But Roxas realized Sora's strength and disappeared. At last, Sora, Riku, and I were reunited. Kingdom Hearts loomed overhead, but Ansem Rise managed to bring its completion to a halt. Sora, alongside Riku, faced the final battle with Zemnis, the last member of Organization 13. And also, if you don't know what's like legit going on with Men of Memory, this is basically Kyrie's dream and memories of Sora and his journeys. Pretty much everybody she been in contact with. This is basically her, her memory of Sora and all that kind of stuff. I think I messed up this like big time. So I did get hit a couple times on this one. I tried to nail this one too. This is actually one of my favorite themes. Um, my theme song here. Also, whatever you do, do not do this thing on hard. You would get wrecked. Like, be like that. <laughs> About this too, it's kind of weird that Kingdom Hearts one sword is fighting Zemnis. I, I don't, I like it, but at the same time, I don't like it. They should have put a like the model for Kingdom Hearts two sword fight him, and have like Riku on the side with him helping them out, just how they doing Goofy and Donald. They should have did a Kingdom Hearts two mod um, or a skin for this. It, it would have been a lot better, to be honest. I'm gonna cut this down. I had to cut it down a little bit. It's too loud. I, yeah, I had messed that one up. I didn't know how I was supposed to hold it. Ooh, I can't wait to fight Zen or oh my god, he's gonna be stupid hard if I do it right. Alright, that's Zimness. Uh <laughs> I did like four misses as y'all can see in the score and stuff like that. was finally defeated. But after the battle, Sora and Riku found themselves trapped in the realm of darkness. 
Suddenly, a bottle washed up on shore. The message inside led them back to the realm of light. Which I don't understand how that happened, but uh, Kingdom Hearts logic, Kingdom Hearts logic, y'all. Oh yeah, this one I get day the uh green uh that three D team. I think I got when did I get team birth by sleep? I I can't remember when I actually got them. I think I got them with not on um, what I did birth by sleep uh, store. And I can't believe they put recorded on here out of all games. I was so happy about that. Like, I was legit happy they put recording on here. But they only did two versions of the song, which is this one and the the one with the bug. They should do the, uh, the red version of this too. Instead of the blue version. But none of this, I still like it. That was that. I could have had an eight, like all platinum rank rainbows. I messed up somewhere. I was paying attention because I'm on my, actually on my computer right now. See, they could have put the red version on here too. Uh, the red version of that song. I need to get back on Get Your Impact. I need, I need to do my dailies for the day over with. <laughs> for um, Get Your Impact. I was kind of playing around with it. <laughs> oh 
Yeah, I think I did good on this one. But this is one, also one of my favorite um, songs from Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, I actually did good with this one. Cause this is also one of my favorite um, soundtracks for Kingdom Hearts in general. Look at that. Full chain, baby. <laughs> Nobody can do it like me. Then again, people can't do it like me. Let me stop. <laughs> Even though it's on standard, but uh, yeah, I don't care about that. Can't do it like me. No, nope. but you can do it like me. Nope. No, we can't do it like you. So shut up. Okay. <laughs> and my fingers up. A strange entry was found in the journal that chronicled Sora's adventures. To investigate, the journal was converted to data. But it was full of bugs. Mickey called on Data Sora to help them restore the world inside the journal. As he restored the datascape, more and more strange messages kept appearing. Mickey and the others should have been watching from the other side of the screen, but somewhere along the way, Data Riku, the embodiment of the journal, had imported them into the datascape to help solve the mystery of the message. I the wish they would have. I wish they would have made this a game, man. Like we make it. The like they did most of the Kingdom Hearts games. That and Data three point eight days over two as well. The connections with his friends and his heart, and used it to fight and forge a path forward. He defeated Sora's Heartless, the bug in the data that had corrupted the journal. That should have been the end of this journey, but Mickey received word that a door to a new world had appeared, and he once again entered the datascape. On the other side of the door was Castle Oblivion. Led by a figure in black, Data Sora repeatedly relived the pain residing in his heart. If he kept holding on to that hurt, he would be dragged down into the darkness. But Data Sora realized that his pain was what tied his memories together. He swore to the cloaked figure, Roxas, that he accepted the pain. The hurt of those connected to Sora remained dormant in his heart. And to help find a way to face and heal that pain, Naminé had left the mysterious journal entry. Their hurting will be mended when you return to end it. Mickey and Data Sora now knew the true meaning of those words. Data Sora thanked Naminé, and they said their goodbyes. Mickey wrote Sora a letter detailing the events that took place in the datascape. You are who you are because of those people. They need you, and now the door to your next journey is ready to be opened. Okay, to be honest, I was actually gonna start with Dream Drop Distance first, but I was like, wait, no. Yeah, yeah, okay, this one I get Team Brush by Sleep. I was actually gonna just start with Dream Drop Distance first, but I was like, no, let's, let's, do, let's do days first. And you're gonna kind of see me like going back and forth, like, which one I'm gonna do first. Um, I actually did, I think that's what I stop at. Yeah, this is what I stop at. <laughs> um, all right, that's the end of this video. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for listening to me talking to myself half the time but um other than that i will see you all next time